Today I have four pairs of WNBA shoes I happen to stumble upon. Let's get into it. The first pair are by Alina Deladon. Let me get into the sizing. So, so these are all women's shoes. I got them in men's sizes. They fit just like men's shoes. I wear a size 10. And the difference between men and women's sizes is a size and a half. But for some of these, they didn't have half sizes. So I just got a size higher. So I wear a size 10 in men's and I got size 11 women's. And these are Elena Deladon from the Washington Mystics. They're called Nike Air Deladon. I'm surprised she, she came out with a signature shoe. It was kind of out of nowhere because, you know, she sat out all of last season due to being denied exemption during the COVID bubble because she had Lyme disease issues and back pain, stuff like that. But she she played this year 70% of the games. She, she rested some because just to rest her back for precautions. These are kind of cool. They got those little Velcro straps. And there's Velcro here and here. So when you open it, you can slide your foot in by sticking it like that. And just Velcro it back together. I like these to be honest. They fit nice. I'm a fan. Her first signature shoe. So, okay, yeah, the prices. Those were 120. These were also 120. These are Stewie Ones. These are Brianna Stortz signature shoe. She plays for the Seattle Storm. That's whose jersey this is. So, oh yeah, so Elena's shoes came out, I think, this month, earlier this month. These also came out this month. Brianna wore these a lot this season in this colorway. I like how they look. My very first pair of Pumas. They're, you know, they're kind of basic looking, but I like them. She tore her Achilles, so she put that little stitch there. She's got her logo here as well. These I got in size 11 women's as well. Now we have two pairs of Candace Parker shoes. The first ones are Candace Parker Exhibit B's. These are Adidas, Brianna's are Pumas, Alina's are Nike's. So I got a little bit of everything. These were $120 as well. I got these from adidas.com. The other shoes I got from DickSportingGoods.com. These have Ace on them for Candace and then a number three. There haven't been anyone with, there hasn't been anyone with signature shoes since 2010, 2011, since Candace Parker. And then 10 years later, which is now, Candace Parker has another pair of signature shoes. So she had a pair 10 years ago and then she's the first to have another pair. And then after her, 
Elena and Brianna also had some signature shoes. These came out a couple months ago in August. These are the tightest fitting out of all my shoes here. These I got in size 11 as well. They have a lot of cushion inside them, so they feel really snug. But all these shoes fit, I've tried them all on. They fit just like a man shoe. There's no difference except the different sizing. Dix didn't send these with a box top, so I just got this from Walmart along with this tissue paper. They didn't have any tissue paper. I don't know what happened, but someone literally cut it off. It's like frayed. Because it should be attached like the other ones and just flop open. These are Candace Parker Exhibit A's. These were released last year in September. The first signature shoe in 10 years by Candace Parker. I like them. These fit really nice as well. And they say Ace. Well, here it says Exhibit A. And they say Ace here on the tongue. That's all of them. These were, how much were these? These were a hundred because they're a little bit older because they came out last year, they were 20 bucks cheaper. I think that does it for the video.